Easy Copy, and the easiest tool when working with graphics. As demonstrated in our training videos, Crop from Selection and Close Curve Crop, using Easy Copy makes it easy to crop one element and place it into another image. However, not all elements are straight lines and easy to follow curves. In this video, we will demonstrate how you, after having made the initial crop, can fine-tune your cropped area. I have opened an image of a cropped element in Easy Copy. You can see how the cropping process didn't remove all of the old background, with the result that it just doesn't look professional. Go to the crop icon and select the function Recall Last Rubber Band, and your last rubber band will appear around the element in a red shape. The little white squares are called notes. You can freely pull them and thereby changing the form of the crop you wish to make. It is through these notes that you are able to change and edit the unwanted parts. With the element cropped, left click on the line and choose Add Note. That will give you a new note to work with. If you click on the note, you can choose to delete it. However, if you look down on the left side of the status bar, you will notice that it gives you advice on how to make shortcuts. Holding down Ctrl and left clicking with your mouse will add a new note on the line, while Ctrl and right click will delete existing notes. A very useful tool in this situation is double clicking on a note. When you do that, you can change between a sharp and a soft note. When working with sharp edges and twisted curves, it comes in very handy. It is now up to you to add, remove or change the note so your cropping can be precise and perfect. Thank you for your time. We hope you enjoyed the guide.